I watched it for the other Autobots. I love the other Autobots, but Optimus Prime is my favorite Autobot. On Transformers 1, Transformers Revenge of the Fallen, Transformers Dark of the Moon, possibly Transformers 4, Transformers Prime, Transformers Animated, Transformers Bot Shots, everything. Transformers G1, Optimus Prime is my favorite character of all time. I love Optimus Prime. I don't care what he looks like because I love his character. I love his personality. I love his valor. You know, Optimus Prime is my childhood hero. He inspired me to be who I am today. Uh, and it's not just like him as the cartoon character or as the movie character. I'm talking about the qualities he represents. You know, all the things that, that, that he's known for. All these things, all these attributes that contributed his character was in, very inspiring to me as a child. So I, I was like, man, I'm gonna be more, more brave like Optimus, or I'm gonna be, you know, I'm gonna make more wiser decisions like Optimus, or I'm gonna, you know, I'm, I'm gonna be humble like Optimus. And I tried to line it up as my own to try to better myself, because that's how much I respected him and I looked up to him as a character, okay? The reason why I love Optimus so much is not because he's a good fighter. You know, it's not really the Transformers part of him that I'm so attached to. It is the values of his character. It is the, the contents of his nature that helped me and that I'm always grateful for. You guys already know my love for this character. You guys know Optimus Prime is the lifeblood. He is the core. He is the matrix of my leadership. And I just, I, I love him so much. I can't say it enough, I can't say it enough times that will account for how much I want to emphasize. This is not only the origin of Transformers, but this is the origin of Optimus Prime, which is my favorite character, and he's the heart and soul of, of, of my appreciation for this, this franchise, and he's, he's, he's a very special character to me, and you guys know why. He's, a, he's amazing. So I'm just pleased to have something like this to represent the beginning of Optimus Prime. I just have such respect and reverence for Peter Cullen. And Frank Welker too, but my my thoughts are on Peter Cullen right now, <laughs> and I just have such respect for him when he is the only voice, the only possible human on this planet that can bring Optimus to life the way that he does. Peter Cullen, I mean the greatest voice actor in Transformers history the world has ever known, I, and I truly mean that. This man, I, I, I'm still mesmerized by his voice, his powerful voice, and so first, of, first and foremost, I just want to say to Peter Cullen, if you just happen to be watching this, thank you. Thank you so much for what you have given to the Transformers community. Meeting Peter Cullen is the biggest thing for me, because y'all know I love Optimus, right? Like, I have lived... I mean, like, my entire, like, Transformers career in love with Prime, and you go back into my history, you'll see, I freaking just love Optimus for many reasons, and you guys know why, so, to finally meet him, him, I'm meeting Optimus Prime, it will be amazing. There he is! <laughs> Alfonso! Hello, Peter Cullen! Oh right, my Before goodness. we get too far into the chat, we're going to take a photo, okay? Yes, yes, okay. All right, ready? Here we go. Three, two, one, perfect. All right, thank you so much. Peter, wow, that's it's amazing to meet you. Um, I've been longing for this for a very, very long time. I've been a, a lifelong fan of Optimus Prime and Transformers. Um, just to give you a quick summary of who I am, I'm Alfonso. I make uh, YouTube videos. I've been doing it for 11 years. And um, I've been making them on Transformers since I was younger. And I've always admired Optimus Prime huh. as, a, as a kid. You know, his, his values and his, his, you know, all the things that he represents, all the great values he represents. It inspired me as a kid to continue to fight through a lot of challenges internally. So it, it's, it's been um, quite a ride and quite an experience. And I've been talking about you for years because I love Congratulations, the way you Congratulations, by the way, for, for sticking with 
something you love to do and never give up. Yes, I mean, sir. even through the dull times and the challenging times, that's that's when you you really do it, and uh, you'll you, you won't regret it. Stay with it, no matter what, Alfonso. Stay with it, buddy. Yes, and sir. You yes, will sir. be happy the rest of your life with it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And you've definitely been one of. Uh... The main inspirations, of course, obviously with Optimus's character, Transformers Prime was my entrance into the franchise. It ah. was my my absolute. I'm die hard for Transformers Prime, and um, I love yeah. the live action films too. It was it, it was so different from G1 because it explored better avenues um, technically, you know, and we welcomed that. It was a, it was a bold new look, but still. Uh, it was capable of sounds, different sounds and uh, different images. Yeah, it was fun to work on. I wish it would come back. Yeah, <laughs> same here. Yeah. Um, my first question would be, what would be your idea or your desire for an Optimus Prime live action origin solo film? Do you have any ideas of what would be the best way to, to tell that story? Well, I think the, the, the anything that would... Uh, take it into space and further away from the uh, uh, from the domestic uh, you know city strife battles you know all that crap and do more of the you know in in cooperation with our with the NASA and with where we're going with the uh, telescopes and where we're going with little helicopters on Mars and uh, exploring that avenue and Cybertron would be, you know, an ex excellent vehicle. I think we're getting closer to understanding, you know, what's out there. So I think we should be out there. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Absolutely. I just want to say one of my favorite things about Optimus is obviously his, his courage and his valor. And what I love with the way that Optimus was born, he was born from your inspiration with Larry and your, your brother who was who was an uh, a hero himself optimus in the flesh and so are you and that's it's like he's a character of of honor and valor and leadership and he was born from inspiration from your brother um so i just think that was a very special special uh uh elements that you've incorporated into that character and i just i admire it so much i can't even well, tell you. Uh, thank you for that uh, thank you um, very much for that. Absolutely. Oh, that's well. Yeah. Well said. Thank you. I mean, how eloquent. <laughs> I try. I'm trying my best you're, here. You're, you're doing great. Thank you. Um, my second question would be, what is your favorite behind-the-scenes moment working on Transformers Prime as Optimus? Um, I think working with the cast. It was a wonderful cast and the opportunity to uh, to experience refreshingly experience um, something that I hadn't felt for you know a couple of decades. So um, it was it was like being reborn, mm -hmm. <laughs> literally. Yes, sir. Um, my next question would be: Have you ever felt like throughout your career, have you ever felt like giving up, and how do you get through any like? struggles whenever maybe sometimes you might uh, endure some challenges how do you get through challenges well uh, everybody does and everybody has the opportunity to save themselves and i think if you look at a problem and you see no solution you just you know there is a solution and uh that's when you just put yourself into low gear and grind and grind through it and uh, never give up, never give in. Always believe in yourself. Always believe that you can do it. Yes, Always. Yes, and sir. you will do it. Yes, sir. It may right. take a little time, but you will do it. Hold on to your dreams. The future is built on dreams. On dreams. That's it. Thank you so much. Um, a lot of fans also face uh, bullying and harassment. Uh, for a living or for, for liking Transformers, what would be your advice to them and how do you, like, what would be your message to them? Well, 
a lot of people are aggressive with their feelings because they don't understand it. Be patient with people like that. Always be patient and uh, don't take it personally because uh, one day, you know, a whole new explanation will be, will be drawn to them and uh, they'll have grown up a little when they see it themselves. So don't worry about it. Be enjoy, be in the enjoyment factor of your life and enjoy that despite them. Absolutely. Absolutely. Um, my uh, another question I have, um, I know you, you've done so much and you've you've contributed, and I also just want to say before I get to this question, thank you on behalf of you know, Fazla Nation, my my uh, YouTube channel, and a lot of people in the community who look up to you. Um, your contribution has been absolutely unbelievable and irreplaceable. The way that you've just delivered Prime with such soul, such passion, and such heart that touched a lot of people. Um, well, Jeff, <laughs> that's a that's a mouthful. Yeah, uh, I digest that with humbly digest that. By the way, Alfonso, that it, it's an honor to be able to be in a position like this, and and um, it's uh, it's a lot of responsibility, and and uh, I take it very seriously. Yes, sir. So that's, thank um, you. For that. Of course, of course. Um, I don't have much more, uh, but I do want to say. Uh, well, I want to ask you, what what do you want to be remembered for? What do you want your legacy to be? The, the legacy of Peter Cullen, the legend. <laughs> oh. Well, grateful, uh, thankful. Thankfully, probably is my greatest feeling is, is the gratitude that I have. And um, hopefully that I have the strength to continue with it and uh, that I don't let anybody down, and especially my family, and uh, and the fandom that has given me all that sense of, of responsibility and dignity that I I value very highly. Thank you, sir. I appreciate that. Um, do you have any advice for any uh, Optimus Prime voice actor that may come in decades from now? I mean, you're, you you set the standard. You are the original Prime. So, any advice for them? Well, never give up on your dream and always oh, you know, pursue it, no matter what. Uh, so, uh, obviously, if you have something inside you and you're capable of accomplishing what you want to do through that, uh, just don't give up. I agree. Continue at it. It's like the human body. You just have to keep working on it. You got to keep working. Got to never give yep. up. And Prime represents that, which is why I love him with all my heart. Um, ah, that's wonderful. If, if if I can ask my last request, I know we're running out of time. Would you be able to say something to the Alfonso Nation or to me, Alfonso, in Optimus Prime's voice? Alfonso, this is Optimus Prime. Hold on to your dreams. The future is built on dreams. Never give up and never give in. Alfonso, transform and roll out. Oh my God. That made my whole career worth it. <laughs> thank, thank you so much for everything. And um, till all are one, keep fighting the noblest of fights, sir. Thank you. Till all are one. Till all are one. Thank you so much. <laughs> That's amazing. Bye, my friend. Bye. Wow, that took a lot. <laughs> that took a lot to hold it in. All right. Well, that's done.
there it was. That was the quickest <laughs> 10 minutes I have ever had. <laughs> like, the quickest 10 minutes I have ever had. I don't even know how that was 10 minutes. That was a lot. <sighs> but I think I got a lot of it out. I got a lot of what I wanted to say. A lot of, you know, the thank you. I got, um, I got pretty much everything out, you know. I, I thought he would be a little bit more long-winded, but he kind of answered them one-on-one, uh, -on -one, one by one, and that was good. I got a lot of questions in, and he did the voice. He did the voice. So expect that to be on the, on the intro. <laughs> okay, well, uh, that's, um, I'm a mess, <laughs> but it happened. It happened, and that was the best thing I could ever go through. That was the best. That was it. That was worth every penny. That was with every pa all the patience, all the nerves. <sighs> that was worth it all. Peter Cullen now knows who I am. He knows my story. I tried to sum it up because those seconds were going down really fast. And yeah, man. So, hope you guys enjoyed this conversation. The moment I've been wanting for a while... I was good at first, and then when I started, when he started giving me advice about never giving up and about fighting through, that's when I started to like rip away. Because <laughs> that's the same exact principle that I've always admired from Prime of what made me a fan and made me who I am. So it's like, uh, it's, it's, it's another level to have him do that for me. Or tell me that directly. That's he spoke directly to the kid on the inside, and that just penetrated every every shielding I've had <laughs> to to endure this. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, I did. This is the single greatest. <sighs> this was the single greatest experience I could have ever asked for. If you've ever questioned if I'm a real fan of Transformers or if I'm authentic or genuine, today's your answer. And today is your evidence. I, I will never be the same again. I will never be the same again. Those words have stuck, it's gonna stick with me for my YouTube and in other things in my life. Peter Cullen just told me directly to never give up. So now it is, it is, it's a challenge and it's a, it, it's, uh, now it's my duty. That's the word. It's my duty now to fulfill those words. Thank you for watching. My name is Alfonso and this has been my experience meeting my childhood hero, Optimus Prime himself. He's just spoke to me. Peter Cullen. Thank you guys for watching. I love you guys so much. And thank you all of you guys um, for everything. I tried to throw y'all name in there, Alfonso Nation, when I could. But the time really went by pretty quickly. So thank you so much, guys. Much love to you all. Never give up on your dreams. The future is built on dreams. So that's all for today. <laughs> that's all I ever needed. Thank you for watching, till all, till all are one. <laughs> wow.